Good morning. How y'all doing today? This is Kay. Happy Thursday morning. Yes, I'm trying to get back on schedule here and get my daily bread in the morning. Sitting here looking at the news, y'all. Drinking my coffee. It's hot. Had to get out cut the air off. You know how after you get out the shower, you uh, be a little hot. And today is trash day, so I had to take my trash out early this morning put it on the curb. So, I can get that gone. So, how y'all doing? How y'all doing? We're going to get into the daily bread this morning. And it's going to be coming out of the book of Matthew. Am I right? Matthew 25 through 37 through 40. Then shall the righteous answer him, saying, Lord, when saw we thee and hungered and fed thee, or thirsty and gave thee drink, when saw we thee a stranger and took thee in, or naked and cl or clothed thee, or when saw we thee sick or in prison and came unto thee? And the king shall answer and say unto them, Verily I say unto you, Inasmuch as ye have done it unto one of the least of these, my brethren, ye have done it unto me. Again, that's Matthew 25, 37 through 40. We should see helping our fellow brothers and sisters as helping God because they are his children. God has commissioned us to be Blessings to all his children, both the lost and the found. When we choose to withhold our help, we are turning our backs on God. Make sure that your heart is set on helping those in need at all times. It is always rewarding. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Dear God, I pray that I never be the person who refuses to help your children. I desire to be a helping hand to as many people as I possibly can be. Father, may I never be stingy with assistance. There is no gain in living that way. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Thank you for that, Jesus. Jesus. I needed that. Thank you for that. Okay, we're going to go over the quiz. I know y'all really do not want me to read this again, but I'm going to read it again. It's long, so y'all try to bear with me with this one. Then shall the righteous answer him, saying, Lord, when saw we thee, and hungered, and fed thee, or thirsty, and gave thee drink, when saw we thee, a stranger, and took thee in, or naked, and clothed thee, or when saw thee sick, or in prison, and came unto thee, and the king shall answer and say unto them, Verily I say unto you, in as much as ye have done in unto one of the least of these, my brethren, ye have done it unto me. Matthew, I hope you enjoyed the daily bread. I hope you enjoyed the daily bread. I just got something I just want to say. Y'all know me, I always got something to say, but... You know, I was just upset about my little old karaoke. That they all over there on the floor, both of them. You see them? I'm taking them back to Walmart today, and whatever happens, happens. If they give me another one, fine. If they don't, they can keep those, and I'll buy me another one. It's just that simple. And I was saying, oh, that's why you ain't, I ain't have nobody else in my house. I'm tired of people breaking my stuff, blah, 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 blah. What did he just say to me this morning? It's my reward going to be great. And I'm really not complaining about it. Like I say, that's just another venting tool of mine. I get in here and sing. It sound all right to me, <laughs> you know. And I play around on it. It's just a little toy, man. That's it. One little toy. Nah, whatever. But never close your doors to people. Always help people regardless of what happens. He say your reward will be great. So, you know, just keep that in mind. It's just I take it personal because I woke up this morning feeling some type of way about my chair with the screws coming out. But it's my chair. And I'm always in it. And I'm the one I always wiggling. Don't nobody sit in my chair. I sit in that chair. So I moved it over there until I can tighten up the screws on it. All I do is screws came out the bottom for me wiggling in it every morning, getting in here talking to y'all. <laughs> so, um... Uh, Everything is good. Let's not be, you know, too hard on people, you know, when they do little things to you and tap and stuff. You know, it's it's nerve-wracking, but eh, we can get other stuff. You know what I mean? So, y'all just take heed to the daily bread today. And do unto others if you would have them do unto you. That's all that's, all that's saying. So, y'all have a blessed and wonderful day, and I hope y'all enjoyed the daily bread. Bye now.